What is most unusual about these flights is that the United States is now deploying the old-fashioned U-2 spy plane, which are now taking part in these missions. This is a blast from the past, from the 1950s Cold War era. It creeps on the cartel from 70,000 feet in the sky and has a long 12-hour loitering time, which allows it to stay on station. This is something that we've never seen before in this region. The upgraded U-2S version uses a new sensor called the Vader Pod that has a synthetic aperture radar and multi-spectral imaging cameras. And here's what I mean. Take a look at this side-by-side -side comparison. We can see how the chemical plumes from a hidden drug lab stand out in the multi-spectral image that the U-2 would see on the right compared to the purely visual image on the left. I know it might look like a red and blue blob of an image to us, but to the trained eye, it looks like a drug lab with a giant red bullseye on it. 